So this is how bullying actually affects the mind. These jeans, remember that woman that I had to get um, fired? I forgot that I had these jeans in the back of my dresser drawer. I shoved the jeans all the way in the back and told myself never to wear these pants just because every time I would come up, she would like grab my hips, turn me around, be like, oh my God, you look so cute. You look so cute. Man, these jeans make you look so nice. You're, you look so good. But then we would be like around a group of like guys and I would be like, can you not try to be like parading me around? You're like, doesn't she look so good? And I'm like, it's my body. I don't care who is complimenting me. Like I wore the clothes I wore because I'm comfortable in it not for a blatant like a weird display of like thirst i think she was just thirsty um and so i was like i don't mind you like being attracted to me but don't put your hands on me and don't you dare parade me around like as if this is your body like oh doesn't she look nice it's like i don't need you to ask for me if i look good girl i know i look good i bought the clothes i bought and so yeah i i find this really sad and and i want to let anybody know that if anybody is sexually harassing you in any way if you feel uncomfortable in your gut or if you're changing your habits or nature or you forget about clothes because you put them away shoved all the way in the back that person was in the wrong they messed with you that's incorrect that's not a good feeling anybody that makes you want to change your clothes your way you walk your behavior the time of day you're you're changing your shifts around anything that seems odd like you know what like is something wrong with me no there's nothing wrong with you. But when you impose other your ideals on other people, when you impose sexual desire on other people, that's incorrect. Don't impose your emotional feeling based off of your own experience on other people because you don't know what they have experienced. I hope that makes sense. But that's my message for the day. Blue jeans. You know what? I'm actually genuinely frightened to go and travel out to Walmart today. To, um, but you know what? I'm going in my squid game clothes. <laughs> That's what I'm going to do. At first, I was going to wear everything that made me uncomfortable. I was going to wear these underwears that made me uncomfortable. I was going to wear these jeans that made me uncomfortable. I was going to wear this shrappy top that was going to make me uncomfortable. Like, what are you doing? Why are you trying to make yourself uncomfortable? So, I'm going to wear my squid game clothes. Proudly. Shower time. to Staten Island, first time going to Walmart in Staten Island. Or first time actually being in Staten Island, <laughs> too, to be honest. We want to get our outfits. <laughs> no, I'm covering it. Yes. Now that's her face. That's the first reveal. That's the first reveal. Oh, you do look hella cute. Okay. Yay. Oh, this is gonna be great.
I love it. I love it. It's so cute. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Oh, you buying it? Oh yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm buying it. I'm buying it. You buying it? And I'm buying her one for backup. <laughs> Happy dance, happy dance, happy dance. You look like you're in a music video. <laughs> oh no, back, no, 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 no. You don't get to see that. <laughs> you first, you first, you first. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm going that way. <laughs> Thank you, you two. Great experience. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. You too. Oh my God, Mayo. <laughs> yep, that's amazing. That's so cool. More daisies. Oh, it was 30% on fair good. That actually was better than the one that was over there. Except the metal piece. The metal <laughs> breast are oh, nice. Oh, look at that. This, this pillow needs to go everywhere. Just don't wake, wake me. me. Just don't wake me. <laughs> Mariah Carey, what? <laughs> oh, girl power. Oh, it's an air freshener. That's too cute. I thought this said ego one home zero. <laughs> like, dang. <laughs> it's like shots fired. <laughs> This is gonna look so good because it's so bright outside today. Yeah. It's, oh, daisies. Oh, it's Mark Jacobs. Miss Dior, love you. You're doing what New Yorkers do best, crossing the middle of the damn street. <laughs> <laughs> It's so funny, I came into the fitting room just to take off my um, leggings underneath because it's just way too hot. So I just use like two, I just grabbed two random shorts I probably would never wear in real life just to take off my leggings. <laughs> you gotta do it, you gotta do it, you gotta be inventive. <laughs> ah, you can't see that shit.
Am I blessed? I am so blessed right now. I'm so blessed. No, my camera's already on. Oh. Hi, can I get a name? Yaya. Yeah, yeah. Do you? I'm gonna get a Reese's. Okay, what can I get for you? Can I get a small Reese's Frozone Blast Sonic? No. Small Reese's Blast, anything else? And then one small uh, Cheesecake Master Shake Oreo. It's melted, but it's fine. I can just deal with it. Hello. So nice. Hand sanitizer? Gracias. Thank you. We're at Walmart, and we'll check back in later. <laughs> yeah, so my my camera glasses are empty officially and my cell phone <laughs> is full. That's good. That means I have Oh, that's a nice work light.